Keeping our children too clean has resulted in a huge increase in the incidence of autoimmune diseases. That's where our immune system has too little to do and begins attacking our own bodies. So current research suggests it's actually a good idea to let your kids eat a bit of dirt every once in a while. Not only that, but some of those parasites we got rid of might turn out to have unexpected benefits. The hookworm, for example. New studies are starting to show that these little invaders may actually hold out hope for people with diseases like lupus, colitis, and multiple sclerosis. Jasper Lawrence had tried for years to control his debilitating asthma. He discovered this research about parasites and eventually set out for the tropics to find the contaminated soil where the hookworm larvae grow. And where do you find contaminated soil? Well, that's easy. Unfortunately, it's really wherever anyone goes to the bathroom, wherever they defecate. You walked around in bathrooms in Cameroon <laughs> to give yourself hookworm. Well, actually, I walked around in, in uh, fecal material in bathrooms. <laughs> oh, my gosh. You're a brave man. <laughs> <laughs> The reality on the ground, the stench, the heat, the humidity, all those things made actually pulling my shoes off and walking around a frightening and repugnant moment. But I've been in remission ever since. It's wonderful. He's now working with Dr. Jorge Yamas in Tijuana to provide hookworms to people who don't want to have to go through the same crap he did. There's what I call the yucky factor because of you know the, the frame of reference that we have that some things are wrong and some things are right and worms for a lot of people are yucky but uh, people are suffering really uh, you know Crohn's disease is a terrible disease allergies are a terrible disease if we are on the right track which i think we are this is going to solve a lot of problems in the world things aren't always what they seem so we have to be very careful when we go messing with an existing system in nature. What looks like a disgusting infection might turn out to be a friend in disguise. And what looks like a delightful pet could be an environmental disaster. Every mistake we make teaches us something new. Let's hope that someday soon we stop making mistakes. Until then, 